Hello everyone, welcome to Static GK quiz number 333. This video is aimed to help you with your state and central government exams like SSC, UPSC, state PSCs, and banking and insurance related examinations like RRB, IVPS, etc. I'm Ritrusha from GK today and I'll be taking you through this. Which are the two countries connected by Karakoram Pass? Correct answer is India and China. The Karakoram Pass is a mountain pass between India and China in the Karakoram range. It is the highest pass on the ancient caravan route between Leh in Ladakh and Yakand in Tarim Basin. Karakoram literally means black grave in Turkic. Which of the following sultans is known to have laid the foundation of Agra city? That would be Sikandar Lodi. Sikandar Lodi had laid the foundation of the Agra city in 1503. He was the son of Balol Lodi. Chenna cultivation is common in which of the following countries? It's very common in Sri Lanka. Chenna cultivation or shifting agriculture is the most primitive type of agriculture known to man from the dawn of civilization and is practiced in Sri Lanka and some other Asian countries. It does not make use of the same piece of land and goes on rotation on crops. India borrowed the idea of the concurrent list from the constitution of which of the following countries? Correct answer is Australia. The concurrent list or list 3 of 7th schedule is a list of 52 items where the last item is numbered at 47 given in the 7th schedule to the constitution of India. It includes the power to be considered by both the central and the state government. Which of the following is India's first national marine park? That honour belongs to Marine National Park of Gulf of Kutch. Marine National Park in the Gulf of Kutch is situated on the southern shore of the Gulf of Kutch in Dev Bhumi, Dwarka district of Gujarat state. In 1980, an area of 270 square kilometers from Oka to Jodia was declared Marine Sikh Sanctuary. The Constitution 108th Amendment Bill is related to which of the following? It is related to providing one third reservation for women in parliament and state legislature. Commonly known as the Women's Reservation Bill, it seeks to reserve one-third of all seats for women in Lok Sabha and the state legislative assemblies. Introduced by the UPA-1 government in May 2008, it also provides that one-third of the total number of seats reserved for scheduled caste and scheduled tribes shall be reserved for women of those groups. Under whose Prime Ministership the Anti-Refection Bill was passed? This was passed under Rajiv Gandhi. So the 10th Schedule of Indian Constitution, also called the Anti-Defection Act, was amended in 1985 to prevent political defections and to stop politicians from changing parties for the lure of office. Anti-defection law bans legislatures from jumping parties. Which among the following is the first Latin American country to sign a preferential trade agreement with India? That would be Chile. A preferential trade area or an agreement is a trading block that gives preferential access to certain products from the participating countries. This is done by reducing tariffs but not by abolishing them completely. This can be established through a trade pact. Which of the following article deals with annual financial statement or budget? That would be Article 112. According to Article 112 of the Indian Constitution, the Union Budget of a Year, also referred to as the Annual Financial Statement, is a statement of the estimated receipts and expenditure of the government for that particular year. Which of the following country was officially declared to be the world's first atheist state after World War II? This was Albania. Albania under Enver Hoxha, became in 1967 the first and to date only formally declared atheist state going far beyond what most other countries have attempted, completely prohibiting religious observance and systematically repressing and persecuting adherents. That's all for today's quiz. Until the next video, goodbye.